guys, veteran trainer John here, and welcome to episode one of the first ever Classy Lock. Now, um, I'm gonna let this cycle through, and uh, we're just um, going to uh, talk real quick here. So, what this is is like it's a randomized Nuzlocke. I randomized the Pokemon, uh, the moves they start with, and um, you know, obviously wild encounters and stuff. Uh, so I have no idea what is going to happen. Um, it's going to be pretty crazy, and hopefully I don't lose right off the bat. That would be pretty embarrassing. Um, I did start this game, but uh, it was uh, before I randomized it. So I don't know the starter Pokemon or anything. Um, this is my first ever randomized Nuzlocke, so let's get this done. Hello there! Glad to meet you! Welcome to the world of Pokemon! My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets, others use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. That would make you a professional professor. But first, tell me a little bit about yourself. I am indeed a boy, and my name is John. Very simple, very quick and easy. And the main difference between this and the Classy Lock, um, Kaz is the craziest name I can think of, is that I can only have uh, one Pokemon of a type on a team. So if I have a Psychic Pokemon, I can't catch another Psychic Pokemon. And that goes for mixed types to dual types, so it's not just primary typing. So that does add a little bit of a challenge. Um, Hopefully I don't run into too many legendaries, and you can't randomize this item, unfortunately. At least not in the randomizer I'm using. If you know one that lets you do that, that'd be pretty cool, and I'll think about that when I do my Gen 2 randomization. Uh, oh, man. So, um, hopefully you guys enjoy this. Question of the day, by the way. I'm going to get on with this early. What is your favorite class of trainer? Mine is obviously veteran. I think it's cool that the game... Uh, has you know like this higher tier of trainer even though they're not like the best trainers I don't think but they're usually pretty good they don't you don't see them until later on in the game all right so we're about to see our starter Pokemon this is usually when other people would like pick my starter episode but if I decided to do that it would take forever for me to get enough votes to even consider waiting that long so I'm just gonna look at them and I'm gonna use my judgment and uh, pick one so we've got uh, plus one, which is never gonna happen. Why not? Which is also never gonna happen. And Kingdra, which is obviously the only decent one that, uh... Yeah, and I have to give an ending to it. Um... I actually know what I'm gonna call this one. But, you know, I'm very terrible with uh, nicknames. And, uh, so I'm going to need suggestions, and I might have spelled that wrong, I'm not 100% sure. So, um, whenever you see this, leave, uh, comment suggestions down below for starters that you think would be cool. And we're about to crush this Why Not, unless it's got, like, freaking the balls. Like, if it's got the nuts, we might lose this. Hopefully, uh, we don't, and hopefully we don't get too overpowered, because I would like to catch something, and why the hell... Is it level 8? Did I royally mess up? <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. And I've got Blizzard and Sheer Cold here. And, um, what the hell? I do hit the Blizzard, <laughs> which is good. I guess. What is this? Oh Jesus. Whirlpool? Okay, well that's quad resisted, so that's not gonna do anything to me. Oh man, this is terrifying. Oh, I wasn't expecting this. Um, hopefully I can do more damage with this. There we go. It was a crit? Hydro Cannon? This guy's got the water moves, man. And that doesn't do anything. Okay, well, fortunately for me, um, I didn't screw this up too bad. This is gonna suck. What did I do wrong? 
I increased their the opponent's levels by too much. There's no reason why he should have. <laughs> God damn it. Well, I guess my first Nuzlocke is probably going to be pretty short. Um, so next episode's question of the day is uh, how long will this last? I'm not imagining too long. I think that I'll get to my first trainer battle and I'll be done skis. So, alright, so, look, I copied, um, I copied what it said on one of those trainer tips signs. Trainer tips, press start over the menu. Fantastic. Actually, that's not a terrible idea. We'll save it. I just like, no. Yeah, yeah, I want to, I want to do this. All right, so we're gonna get on route one. Obviously, Nuzlocke hasn't started yet. We don't have any Pokeballs, and I just kind of want to scout ahead at what's going on around here. Um, kind of glad I didn't gain that level. Mike Jenna, which is pretty dope. I don't know if I'd want one on my team, but uh, it'd be pretty cool. I don't know why I went for Thunder Punch. I was just intimidated. He's got the Fitz Curl, dude. He's got the sickest moves. All right. So Onslaught is like, you know, I didn't think I spelled that right. So I am gonna gain a level. That's cool. And um, all right. So that's one Pokemon. Let's get this other potion because God knows we're probably gonna need it. All right. And here we go. Boom, boom. Psyduck. That would be pretty easy to catch. Uh, let's see how much Thunder Punch does. Um, it KOs it. It KOs it. Okay. All right. You know, no big, no big deal. I kind of figured as much. So Blizzard would probably be our best chance at catching that. I'm. Not wanting to gain a whole level here because I don't want to get too overpowered and makes catching Pokemon impossible. I think I did turn legendaries. Venusaur would be legit. I don't even know if I can. I don't even think Blizzard would take this out, but I have to find out. It does. Okay, so definitely Thunder Punch the Venusaur, even though I'm gonna be level seven which Thunder Punch still won't take it out there's no way right. hopefully um, we're gonna the goal here for this one is to battle Gary get comfortable enough that we can battle Gary not get crushed and hopefully catch at least one Pokemon per route um, it's gonna be hard especially if we get a Venusaur uh, to get that because Venusaurs have a low catch rate and it sucks. That's kind of why I turned legendaries off because they're just a waste of pokeballs at this point. There's no way I can catch her, catch them, uh, and it's just not worth it. And um, I think I turned off broken moves, so none of them should have like Dragon Rage or Sonic Boom. But just in case, I'm gonna say this now: if I lose a Pokemon to Sonic Boom or um, Dragon Rage, at least in the point in the game where my Pokemon don't have uh, 40 HP yet, or obviously like, maybe like level 20, I will probably just, uh, not count it as a loss. Alright, what's that? You have something for me? Delivered his Pokeball. Alright, let's get this over with. Thank you, Gramps! Gramps! I almost forgot what you're calling for! I'm gonna change his tone every time. Um, so we're gonna get our Pokedexes and Pokeballs. And the Nuzlocke will begin. Hopefully we don't get shafted too bad on our first Pokemon. And hopefully I can come up with a sub-decent nickname. Uh, let's think. I gotta think of subscribers. Um, Onslaught is a subscriber. Alright. Hate to say it, but this won't be necessary for you to come along. I'll borrow a town map from my sister. I don't need a town map because I know this game like the back of my damn hand and uh, I know what I'm doing, okay? I'm kind of good at this. I am a Gen 1 -er, by the way. Through and through, Gen 1, nostalgia, love it, love the original games. Venusaur! Venusaur! 
bitchin' sore is more like it. I've got a name for you. Badoom! That didn't do anything. Absorb, he's got stab! Oh, good. Oh, good. That's so good. Let me catch you. Fake out! Dude, fake out Venusaur. New meta. Let's go. Come on, get paralyzed. Oh, I outspeed this time. No, what's he got? Oh, okay. I was under the impression he had, like, some, some weird kind of counter or something. That would be worst case. So, we're going to attempt to catch you now. Because we've seen absorb and fake out. Come on. Get one the Pokeball. Yes. What? All right. So we've got our bitchin' sore. Yes. Oh. What am I? Kindergartner? Alright. Oh, it just fits. Alright. So that is gonna be our Route 1 Pokemon, and this is looking legit as hell. Way better than I could have ever hoped for. We've got our Dragon, we've got our Water, we've got our Grass, and Poison types on lock. Um, and I just rested one too many times. No big deal. Alright, so let's see. Summary. Uh, he should have four moves. Fake out, absorb, ice punch, and crush claw. Dude, I've got the elemental punches and item take sunstone from onslaught, so that's cool. Uh, so we've got bitch and sar. Yeah, I'm gonna need help with nicknames, guys. I'm gonna need help. All right, so maybe we can get you up a few levels. Um, ice punching other relincant. You're rock water, aren't you? My Absorb will be, like, freaking killer. Hopefully you don't have anything ludicrous. Oh, yeah. There we go. Present? Ooh. Oh, come on. That was rude. All right. So, Rolling Camp would have been, like, a dead, uh... A dead... All right. Ooh. We got a battle? All right, sweet. Sorry, guys. Alright. Really can't down. Venusaur gains... Bitchinsaur. My bad. Bitchinsaur gains a level. Pedal dance. Oh, yeah. You're learning that. So. Fake out is not worth... Alright, sorry about this guys, I am getting a battle getting a battle set up so that I can record another battle for you guys. Cause that's what everyone comes here for. Not even gonna lie, I'm not fooling myself. I'm a battler, not an LP -er. This is kind of just because it's been really difficult finding battles lately, it really has. I mean maybe it's because I'm only available at the weirdest of times and it's no one's fault. Septile? Grovile, not Septile. Grovile. Alright, that would have been an interesting catch as well. Ice Punch is probably going to be enough, though. I think. Yeah, it is. So, let's get you to at least level 7. 60? Oh, yeah. Dude, leveling up for days, man. Alright. I kind of want to grind here a little bit. I know it's kind of shitty. I know... Cleffa. Okay, well, I'm up. Uh... Pedal dance you because I hate you. Alright. So, I think I'm going to do that, then come back. And then, uh. Yeah, record a battle, come back to recording the Nuzlocke. Do a little bit of grinding because, um, I think that would put them. 
if they're level three, that's like 50% higher than normal. Which would mean Brock would have Pokemon around level 20. And um, that would be bad for me. And uh, there would be very short Nuzlocke for sure. Alright. So hopefully we don't get duplicate types. I mean obviously I can still catch it. I just have to box it and um, that's not very good and then obviously I have to do the stupid catching tutorial and I think we will have enough time to get at least the battle with Gary done so I'm gonna get, uh, I'm gonna get 12 Pokeballs and two potions cause I did get hooked up I got some pretty legit Pokemon with me right now so I'm not like too terrified early on but if like if that's really 50% um Oh man, like, I might have to come back in and refix it. And I hate to do that, because I've already started it. Elixir, that's not bad, not bad at all. So this is going to be our second encounter over here. Um, so, I, sh yeah, Route 22. So Obviously, don't want to go too far, because I don't want to battle Gary yet. I'm not quite ready. I would get crushed. Teddy Ursa! A normal type that is pretty cool um, absorb is should easily not be able to take this thing out but I think Teddy Ursa is sort of hard to catch fight no big deal um, hopefully we uh, can catch him no problem and water pulse I can eat that up I did a whole two damage that's actually kind of Obnoxious! Alright, let's get... Man, I kind of want to go for one more. I'm going for it. Come on, low rolls, baby! Thank you. Oh, thank you. Alright. Um... Now, nickname for Teddy Ursa. I don't legitimately know. I don't know what I'm going to nickname him. Um, uh, I do like the Teddy Ursa line. It is my absolute favorite line of um, bear type evolutions. Even though it is the most basic. Oh, come on. You've literally got one HP. You're literally, like, almost about to be passed out. Yes! Alright. Teddy Ursa! Alright. I've got the nickname for you. Cuddles. Alright. Maybe I'm not too terrible at this. Maybe, maybe I just gotta open my mind a little bit. Let's see what else we could have had. Oh, shit. Let's see what else we could have had here. And then, uh... Oh, well, that would have been, I would have had to get rid of you anyways, because of dupes. Helping hand. Nice. If you survive this, go for it again, please. That's great experience. I would have loved that. See, this is also another reason why Absorb is super clutch, because it's got this really low base power. And it's stab, but it's like so weak, I can actually catch something. Pursuit? No, it's not worth it. Level 8! Maybe it did randomize their learning moves. That would actually be kind of annoying. I kind of want them to have like some... Okay. Okay. Sand Slash would have been, you know, interesting to catch as well. I think I'm going to go absorb here and try to get some health back. Uh, maybe bad idea. Nah, it's good. It's a good. It's good. Water Sport. Bro. I'm gonna have to put Kingdra in to get some uh, training because Bitchin' Sore is a uh, bitchin'. Alright, so that's cool. I think I'm actually getting my DS up while I'm here. Alright. So, yeah, this, I got too much shit going on. I need a bigger desk. Hashtag Patreon for bigger desk. Alright, we're level 9. 
That's cool. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna swap onslaught in here. And then I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go ahead and move up to the uh, next route. Probably get all of my Pokemon to level 10 um, if I can. Teddy Ursa shouldn't be too rough to level up, uh, even though Ursaring is a badass, but it doesn't evolve for quite some time, so. Oh man, and I know the lighting isn't perfect. I think I might actually go cut one of the other lights on, but um, I don't know. I, I kind of like the uh, the just my computer screen basically. There is one light on, but I know it's still pretty dark in here, and that's uh, not very cool. So you're gonna have to deal with this stupid um, yeah. Alright, uh, I hate this. I hate how they made it mandatory in yellow. Uh, like, it's kind of obnoxious. Oh, it's got a lantern. That would be unusable if I caught it. So normal types are taken off. So I can't have any flying types unless it's like... Ah, uh, that does kind of stink. And I don't really need fly. Fly is just kind of a, kind of a convenience thing. So, I mean, I guess it's not that big a deal. I'll suck it up. I made the rule. I'm sticking to it. Um, yeah, unfortunately. Uh, Alright, let me get the TGTV, which is kind of useless. Uh, I wish I had my running shoes. That would have been nice to get. But I, we don't get that too often. Be Brock, which uh, might be next episode. I'm trying to get, like, certain milestones done each episode so there's not too much going on. Azumarill, that is our, um, that was our encounter. Kind of a bummer, but I mean, I guess it, it has got Shockwave. Um, well, let's see how much damage this does. Yeah, okay, did nothing. <sighs> okay. This shouldn't take it out. Yeah, no, that's too low damage. That's so weak. I have to use all of them to even get a chance. Alright, well let's just hope we hit all of these. Maybe we'll get a freeze. Uh, that would be best case. Freeze gives you a pretty high chance to catch. And we've got to go deposit this Pokemon right away if we catch it. Which is inconvenient, but it is what it is. Alright. Cross chop again. And I'm gonna go for my last blizzard, and I, of course I miss Hydro Cannon. Stab Hydro Cannon is hard as this is, though. All right. I'm not gonna try too hard to catch you. I don't really see you being useful. I mean, I guess if I get to a point where I just need just a mono water type. But any other attack I do will take you out, and I'm not comfortable swapping in a Teddy Ursa on you when you've got Hydro Cannon. Yeah, I'm gonna just, I think I'm gonna just continue on. I don't, I don't need this encounter right now. Yeah, I'm gonna just, I'm not gonna waste too much time. I, I don't think I can catch it without weakening it more, and I can't bring in Ursa. So I'm going to go ahead and try to get this encounter, and then I'm going to go, I'm going to try to level up some guys and uh, get Bar Gary's battle done in a, the next five minutes, so we got some time, we got some time, uh, maybe I should have Teddy Ursa out, but we'll see, we'll see what we get, we'll see what we get. This Pokemon should be a little higher level, probably five or six. Um, Togedic, which is normal flying type. So, I uh, should... I'm gonna try double edge. It's not super effective. And that works! Unless he has... Okay, he's going for Hydro Pump. I don't know why. I don't know why. Let's do this. So, <laughs> unfortunately, someone is getting, uh, bagged. 
Aromatherapy. That's cool. That's useful. That's useful. This is my last encounter of the episode. And it might not be an easy catch. So, I don't want to... I don't want to lose this encounter though. Because I need a backup Pokemon in case something goes really south. So obviously, you know, the lock's not over until all your Pokemon faint. Damn it. So I think I'm stuck really trying to catch this guy. He's not doing any damage to me. Pros of being a Kingdra. Relatively bulky. Alright, there we go. Alright, Togetic is caught. And then a little hope. Alright. So Teddy Ursa is probably gonna get boxed because Tokadix is just pretty useful. Hop it. See, that's sort of useful. Kind of. I mean, sort of, not really. But I mean, it would have been. Ingrain. It's it's grass flying, so I guess I guess that actually would have worked. It's obnoxious. Well, whatever. All right. It's time to gain some levels so we can freaking go battle uh, Gary. Okay. And I think I'm gonna need to use a potion here. And I don't think Lil Hope is gonna get a chance to. And really to get Cascoon? Alright. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother that. You know, I could have sheer cold it. Lovely kiss? Oh, are you kidding me? I forget. Alright. I don't know if there's a speed up on this thing either. Come on! Thank you! Crush Claw! And you're dead. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Dive Ball! That's pretty cool! I'm not gonna lie. So let's let's get some grinding done. At least I want to get to at least level 10, and that's no PP level. Just cause you're gonna make me twitch, man. Making me twitch, making my hair get all spiky. Fire blast! You've got fire blast? Okay, that's cool. I kind of wish I would have caught one of you, even though it wouldn't have done anything because you're a cascoon. But I mean, it's cool. It's pretty. It's pretty cool. Extreme speed. <laughs> Excuse me? What? That's sick. That's that's pretty dope. I not even like Okay, I'm gonna half use a potion. No big deal. I've got four. Alright, so let's oh what's, what's this? Alright. Pardon me for one second. I am going to stop recording and be. Hey guys, I'm back. Sorry about that jump cut. Anyways, that was a Stardust, I think. So, um, hmm. Fortunately, I got a phone call, and that is going to cut our episode a little short. Uh, I'm gonna go hill up. I'm gonna go deposit Teddy Ursa, and that's gonna be it for episode one of the Classy Lock. Hope you guys enjoyed. I know it wasn't as action packed as I wanted it to be. Uh, we just caught a few Pokemon and we're gonna have to box a few, or box one. Which is good, it's good to have a backup in case shit goes south really quick. Um, and then uh, we've got our flyer, so that's good as well. Um, and uh, unfortunately guys, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I got a call and it took up too much time. I'm gonna store you here. And we haven't lost any Pokemon yet, which is good. And, um... I might fix the level thing. Uh, maybe. Probably. 
Hopefully, if doing that doesn't mess with everything too bad. But that's going to be it for episode one. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate everything you do. I fixed the lighting, by the way. And that's going to be it for me. Thank you guys. Later. Stay tuned for more content. Bye-bye.